What's up, you beautiful cruisers? Um, I know what you're thinking. Two videos? One day? How did I get so lucky? Well, this isn't actually a cruise news video. This is a, um, this is more of a confession video. Um, for those of you that know me uh, on here by now, um, I had a cruise planned for November. It's actually an inaugural cruise. And uh, this happened to me, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. It was one of those days, it was like 50 degrees outside, or negative 50 degrees outside, so it was uber cold out. And, uh, you know, I had a day off of work, so I was walking home, or I was walking home. I just woke up first thing in the morning, like I always do, and uh, made myself a cup of joe, sat down to... Um, go through a couple emails and I got an email from Norwegian and uh, you know you know how that goes uh, reading it and got somewhat upset and took it out on a stuffed animal that didn't see it coming anyways with that said um, the email said that uh, they have canceled my cruise to extend the inaugural cruise uh, season for that for the new Encore boat. Uh, this is a cruise that I was really looking forward to. Uh, personally, you know, we actually had a lot of deaths in the family this year. And so it couldn't have hit me at a worse time. Uh, but what can you do? Do I blame Norwegian? No, absolutely not. Would I have done the same thing? Absolutely. This boat is going to be amazing. It, it is going to uh, revolutionize what Norwegian is going to do on their boats. It looks just absolutely insane. Uh, for those of you that don't know, it's got uh, the, a bigger racetrack course on it for go-karts. It's got... Um, laser tag a huge laser tag uh course on it and it's got something um where it's going to use virtual reality on it which looks just cool regardless um was i mad at first absolutely uh it actually gave me a pretty bad taste in my mouth but uh, in the long run you know what Norwegian to me right now is probably one of the better uh, cruise liners out there. Uh, I've never had a bad taste or a bad experience. Uh, so more hats off to you. Worst, the worst thing that happened to me really was I had to book the same cruise just two weeks later. Would it have been cool to have been there for an inaugural cruise? Yes, but you know what? That's, uh, that's not a bad problem to have. So with that said... Adios, everyone. Have a great week ahead, and I will see you this time next week. So, deuces.